case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1987, the United States District Court for the Northern District of Illinois heard the case O'Neill v. Coca Cola Company which revolved around allegations that Coca-Cola and PepsiCo violated antitrust laws. The two companies were accused of acquiring certain bottling facilities, leading to reduced competition and increased prices for consumers. A class of all purchasers of Coca-Cola and PepsiCo carbonated soft drinks sought representation, joined by additional complaints filed by Louis Klein, Arthur Slavin, Caroline Corley, and Royal Crown Cola Company. Dixie O'Neill, the primary plaintiff, claimed that PepsiCo's acquisition of MEI and Coca-Cola's acquisitions of Beatrice and JTL through CCE violated antitrust laws. The court was tasked with examining the evidence supporting O'Neill's claims and determining her standing to assert them. The backdrop of the case included Coca-Cola's proposed acquisition of Dr. Pepper and PepsiCo's attempted purchase of 7-Up both of which led to further complaints and FTC proceedings. Ultimately, PepsiCo abandoned its agreement to purchase 7-Up. In the end, the court granted both defendants' motions to dismiss O'Neill's claims due to insufficient evidence and lack of standing. As a result, the plaintiff's claims were dismissed in their entirety. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for Visit lsd.law Elevate your mind Leave the stress of class